Hello, welcome to this video, Claude Emir here again, and today let's talk about interference in CCTV. So if you're using coaxial cable, be careful, you need to understand some things so you can avoid the interference. And that's what you can learn in the Ultimate Security Camera Guide. I have a link here in the description, you can click, take a look at the guide, and you can download this guide to learn more, right? And also don't forget, subscribe to this channel, hit the thumbs up, and leave your comments and hit the bell notification to receive more information about new videos, okay? So here in the screen, I have this presentation about interference in coaxial cables. Here I have uh, a cable. As you can see, there is a braid and a conductor. So they work together. The conductor is going to carry the signal from the camera, the video signal, and the braid is gonna be the reference, right? It's the reference for the signal. So it's a common ground. You need to have braid to work together with the conductor. And the braid also works uh, to avoid interference in the cable. So make sure you have good cables with good quality, with braids like uh, with 85 or 90%, that's good enough for you. And here in the diagram, you can see an example of the interference. The interference is uh, electromagnetic interference, for example, comes here to the cable, the coaxial cable, and then the interference can run in this cable, uh, arrive here in the camera, in the pole, and then go to the ground, right? So you need to ground your system. Here's an example. Uh, this diagram shows some grounding here, but there is more information in another video here in the channel about how to ground properly, right? You can't just ground your system. If you don't know what you're doing, you can make even worse, okay? So here is just an example of grounding. You're gonna have more information later in other videos. So that's the reason you must subscribe to this channel, okay? You can also ground your DVR just like that. So the interface comes to the cable, goes to your DVR and goes to the ground. So just make sure you have the correct ground and also the correct cable with quality and good braid, okay? So you can avoid all those bad interference in your system, okay? And guys, I have more information in videos that are coming, so don't miss the next videos. So subscribe to this channel, hit the thumbs up and hit the, also the bell notification to receive more information, okay? And I see you in the next video.